So a question to you all people. So did you notice the use of the word encoding and decoding time and again? So another question to you is the interpreting. Because the one simple question I want to ask you. Have you ever asked two or three different colleagues inside your design, manufacturing or inspection team and you have shown a GDNT callout? GDNT callout is basically wherever GDNT is used in your drawing and got two to three different interpretation. How can that be? But really we used to have this. So three different people they interpret in three different ways. That is the misunderstanding and that is the way where the GDNT is used in an interpreting way. That means that is not mathematical, right? 2 plus 2 equal to 4 and sometimes 2 plus 2 equal to 4.1. That cannot be like that. So during this process today, we are going to reveal that how this can. I will give you the right example also today. This is not a demo or kind of thing. Here you will feel everything what I am showing you, what I am discussing. So surely if GDNT is used to decorate or paint your drawing for later interpretation, then of course don't use GDNT. It is useless. So we are here to explain you about the GDNT that is not only must but absolutely can be encoded and decoded. That means I guarantee you that we only use encoded and decoded we don't interpret. And if it is then it will deliver with greater benefit that is no doubt about it. So we understood about the GDNT the the first scenario and different myths, misconception and what need to be done. But primarily the point here is what is the logic of GDNT? Then we'll move to other topics like the necessity of GDNT and the GDNT encoding process, decoding process and so on. So let us talk about the logic of GDNT. If you talk about the logic there you have different set of instruction like a concept, different tools you will be using. Tools are basically symbols like a positioning tolerance, a perpendicularity, straightness, flatness and cylindricity and over the point how to define your features and rules. Rules are very important. In GDNT you have primary three rule. Rule number one, two, three and you have a process to interpret it and best practice. And once you talk about all these five different sets then you are done. So let us talk about the concepts and tools. Then we little bit will brush up about rules and process and other parts. And also we'll touch on this three point. Touch means basically I'll just talk about the rules also. So first of all the perfect imaginary world of GDNT. Just you conceive in your mind that I'm talking about the imaginary world of GDNT. That means in your mathematics you can completely interpret the probable scenario what could happen in your manufacturing but this is not probability this I'm talking about guarantee so we can guarantee mathematically the occurrence inside your inspection and manufacturing through your design teams intervention through the imaginary mathematical world of GDNT. So the best three worlds so what are those if you talk about a tolerance zone that means different kind of objects you manufacture so primarily you can have a thickness kind of thing where you have a thickness or width. You have a cylindrical thin object or a solid cylindrical object where you have a variation. Here you can see the damage diameter will get varied and here the thickness will get varied and here also the flat slabs thickness also will get varied. So tube like cylindrical and slab like so three different imaginary worlds GDNT uses this kind of different interpretation and tolerance values if you see the size of the tolerance zone in case of your wall thickness or tube like this thickness will get varied as well from the axis the diameter across the different point also will get varied as well the thickness just like here the flatness the straightness and the width they will get varied based on the different manufacturing process and in case of cylindry features from the center the solid diameter also will get varied and you can have a tapper or you can have a curved scenario which can also occur. 
and next is the datum datum is basically the perfect imaginary reference point if you manufacture this this cannot be perfect but wherever you inspect this that you assume that as if that is a perfect reference plane so with respect to that your inspection gauging tool you create your cad model cad model you get completely perfect flat your inspection tool kit or in, uh, inspection sets also they seems like perfect but after manufacturing the real part we are never getting like the datums so datums are the way where we say that our parts are approaching towards your perfect by referring your gauging instrument so that is this point so you could gauge a point a line a plane point with a line a plane over the edge point line and plane so different interpretation of the object if you talk about this corner your edge point surface all interpretations are there so we are talking about this if you only talk about a point that is about a sphere where how can you gauge a sphere where is the imaginary point that is a center point so different ways we devise but a single rule we use and coordinate system is from where our zero zero reference is and that is the vital and important part and if you talk about the basic dimension inside your drawing this basic dimension never changes you cannot apply tolerance to a basic dimension i will discuss just in a minute so if you see this particular cylinder's location may be from some other part at a particular location in x direction and y direction and you can see the location is absolute so that other pin or hole will get assembled to this so you cannot have a, you know the tolerance to this so this is a basic dimension but you can have different other control so how to deviate from the standard to the non standard but still that is not getting rejected that is the part of jdnt so what are the different rules that i will show you and finally a symbolic language that means if all the controls tools where you drive inside your imaginary world of jdnt but that always scattered to your real world